Happy Friday. It is the first Friday of 2019. Yay, we made it. I'm doing my Bible study slash daily devotional. I've already gone through the daily devotionals. Now I'm reading my verse of the day, uh, chapter of the day, which is Proverbs chapter four, because today is Friday, January 4th. So I'm going to read uh, Proverbs and tell you exactly what I do when I'm reading. I circle certain words as I'm going. And then later on, I write about those specific words inside of my journal. So that way I take the words from here, put them in my journal and process them in my mind and make the information my, my own. And then eventually someday I'm going to commit some of this stuff to memory But for now, I'm reading it, digesting it, processing it, understanding it, and then I'm I'm going to be able to memorize it and be able to share it with somebody. So here we go. Proverbs 4, get wisdom at any cost. Listen, my sons, to a father's instructions. Pay attention and gain understanding. I give you sound learning, so do not forsake my teaching. For I too was a son to my father, still tender and cherished by my mother. Then he taught me and he said to me, take hold of my words with all your heart. Keep my commands and you will live. Get wisdom, get understanding. Do not forget my words or turn away from them. Do not forsake wisdom and she will protect you. Love her and she will watch over you. The beginning of wisdom is this. Get wisdom. Uh, Though it costs all you have, get understanding. Though it, uh, well, no, no, no. Cherish her and she will exalt you. Embrace her and she will honor you. I like that last part. Cherish her and she will exalt you. Embrace her and she will honor you. I love it. Um, and then we're going to go up here. Uh, she will give you a garland to grace your head and present you with a glorious crown. Listen, my son, accept what I say and the years of your life will be many. I instruct you in the way of wisdom and lead you along straight paths. When you walk, your steps will not be hampered. When you run, you will not stumble. Hold on to instruction. Do not let it go. Guard it well, for it is your life. Do not set foot on the path of the wicked or walk in the way of evildoers. Avoid it. Do not travel on it. Turn from it and go on your way. For they cannot rest until they do evil. They are robbed of sleep till they make someone stumble. They eat the bread of wickedness and drink the wine of violence. The path of the righteous is like the morning sun, shining ever brighter till the full light of day. But the way of the wicked is like deep darkness. They do not know what makes them stumble. My son, pay attention to what I say. Turn your ear to my words. Do not let them out of your sight. Keep them within your heart. For they are life to those who find them and health to one's whole body. Above all else, guard your heart. For everything you do flows from it. Keep your mouth free of perversity. Keep corrupt talk far from your lips. Let your eyes look straight ahead. Fix your gaze directly before you. Give careful thought to the paths for your feet. 
and be steadfast in all your ways. Do not turn to the right or to the left. Keep your foot from evil. Amen. May the Lord add a blessing to the hearers and the doers of his word. Amen.